All right, welcome back to LearnWire. Now, uh, I listen to you guys a lot when you guys give me comments on my videos. I really enjoy reading the comments. It has gotten a little out of hand where I'm not able to keep up. As you can see, I, there's just way too many comments for me uh, to answer, and I'm just not able to answer all of them. Um, but I do see them and I do read all of the contents. Uh, or comments, but sometimes I'm just not able to answer back. And I apologize for that, guys. I'm sure you guys understand that. Um, but one did stand out uh, last week, and it's from My Pure Path, uh, someone that comments on the videos a lot. I really appreciate you. And they said, dude, sorry to do this here. I need to get your number or email, kind of like insinuating that when something big happens or a new product hits, AppSumo, they want to text me or something, you know, and let me know, hey, don't miss this. Uh, put this on your channel. I really appreciate you guys when you guys do things like this. But um, it, you, my pure path alerted me that PepperType is back. And I've gotten to the point where I'm not actually on AppSumo, even though I do a lot of AppSumo reviews. And that's been one of the main drivers of this channel, EarnWire, um, I haven't been visiting AppSumo, um, you know, daily. Maybe I'll, I'll hit it uh, once a week or something like that, and maybe I'll plan what videos I want to do. Um, but it's really nice when you guys come in and uh, let me know what's going on on the platform as well. So I appreciate that, guys. Uh, so apparently, um, PepperType is back. At the time um, of the comment, it was 14, 14 days. Um, I believe that was a few days ago, so it's about 11 days now. And he said, do it. That means make a video on pepper type. So that's what we're going to be doing. Thanks again, uh, my pure path for the um, alert and the comment. Much appreciated. Let's go over to AppSumo and you can see the number one featured uh, product that they are featuring on their entire site out of probably 2000 plus softwares. They are featuring pepper type and why wouldn't they Right? it had over a thousand five star reviews. Uh, this was a major, major hit last year. One of the best softwares that probably was released um, in that entire in the entire year, um, and it definitely was one of the highest quality AI writers. We know that last uh, this year, or maybe like the last twelve months, has been you know the AI writing. Uh, you know, there's just been AI writers everywhere uh, coming out on AppSumo, right? And it, it got to a point where we saw these last few ones, we saw some pretty bad ones, right? Um, and so uh, pepper type, I picked up a uh, tier three copy. I think I have a hundred thousand words per month and I did go all in with pepper type. Now I will admit, I don't use, this isn't a software I use daily. There was a time where I was using it daily and I got to admit, um, because I have so many AI writers, I actually, actually kind of forget what softwares I have in my bucket. Um, pepper type is one of them that I was using for an e-commerce site. Um, I really, really liked using pepper type for one of my e-commerce websites to get product descriptions and things like that. Um, and so, but pepper type is a very unique uh, AI software. And you can see right here, we're going to go ahead and click on it with 1072 reviews. And you can literally see that there is, I mean, it's probably a, a 4.9, um, star rating. So really, really good stuff. Let's see what <clears throat> their current pricing plan looks like. So license tier one, $99. Um, it looks like they have a license tier two and three. I would have to go back to my video to see what pricing is actually going on. But, um, from the looks of this, it looks like the pricing is, has gone up. Looks like the pricing has gone up, but um, you guys can go back to my find my pepper type review from like a year. That was probably one of the first videos that I ever did on this channel. And um, I don't know if it's actually ranked uh, in the in the top right now or not, but you could go back and see what the pricing was when I did my uh, review video. And it has had to have been a year about a year ago. Um, so but it, the, the pricing just feels like it's probably has gone up a little bit. Um, if I come down here and look at the tiers, a uh, hundred thousand words at 249. That almost sounds about right though, actually guys that, uh, so if you guys want to go and do the research and, and leave it in the comments, but I feel like I paid, um, over $200 for my t license tier. 
and I know that I only have a hundred thousand words, so maybe the pricing didn't go up, but um, nonetheless, this is a really good deal. Uh, coming in at $99 right here for 50,000 words a month, that's still, that's a really good price. And I'm going to show you why, because I'm not going to go over all the other things and all the features. This isn't really a review. We're just going to go use the software right now. Okay. So uh, I want to go over to the site and just show you, here's the website. Um, apparently they have Spotify and Disney um, Plus is using this, Yale. Um, some pretty big brands using this software. Um, they have a hundred thousand active users on pepper type right now. Um, 5 million content pieces generated, um, and so forth. So some stats, um, I like to come in here. Obviously they have some really good Captura and trust pilot, um, is, is doing really well for them. This is a really solid software. Everything checks out with this software. Um, you know, plagiarism free. Yes, it's plagiarism free. Um, you can use it for commercial use. Um, and so forth. And I'm going to come back up here and we'll go and look at their pricing um, on the website. Let's come over here and just click on the pricing. Um, and I, this is why I want to show you that, you know, people are signing up. They, they do, they run Facebook ads. They, they are building their business and they're doing a really good job. And here's a good test. I like to go and see what their web vitals look like. And you can see that they're getting 264,000 visitors per month with a 23% bounce rate. This is a very legitimate business. Um, and so, uh, they're, they're doing really good. I've got a, a community. They, they, they are a good example of a software that came on hit AppSumo with a life, lifetime deal. And then they continued the software over a year after and continue to build the business. Okay. And continue to improve the software. I'll show you the roadmap in just a minute, but here's what I wanted to look at. So the pricing over here, they don't even have the ability right here. I don't know how you upgrade. You probably have to sign up for the, um, for the $35 a month plan or the 50,000 words before you can get offered even more words, right? So they're big on teams, getting a license for multiple people on your team. You can get a discount by going with a team right there. Um, but um, see how the words don't go up because you're buying user seats, but you can uh, save 20% by going annual. So $400 uh, um, if for the year, you get 50,000. Um, so that right there will, will sell this software to you. You can pay $400 every day. So a few days ago before they were on AppSumo, this is what you would pay for the year, $400, um, for tier one, you'd pay $400 a year right now. You can get it for one fourth, the cost, $99, 50,000 words per month, but you would never have to pay again. So, um, it's, you just pay one time, right? You guys know what the lifetime deals are. So that's a really good deal. This is, um, the pricing that actually is on their website. Now, if you want more words, I don't really know how you work that out with them, but there is something down here. Can I use the generated copy? Where is it? Uh, how to get unlimited words. I'll click on that. You can contact them right here and they will um, introduce you to the enterprise plan and truly get unlimited copies. They do have a fair use policy that they use. Uh, so obviously you're not going to be able to probably do millions of words per month or something like that, but, uh, you know, probably somewhere in the hundreds of thousands if you needed that. Um, so this is, I don't know, they don't have it on their site, you know, for a hundred thousand word plan or a 200,000 a month, uh, word plan, but I'm sure they will work that out with you. But, uh, you know, the, the pricing is, it's a good price. If you go and compare this to Jasper or any of the other softwares, um, but it also is a little bit on the, you know, the, the, the premium side, uh, 35 bucks, 50,000 words. That's a little cheaper, I believe than, uh, I think Jasper's around $50 a month for the 50, um, thousand word plan, or it might even be a $99, not sure, but nonetheless, not a comparison video. Just wanted to show the facts over here that that's what you actually would pay daily. And people are signing up. They um, have been off the platform for a very long time and they have continued to grow their business. So, uh, they have a roadmap over here. They have a change log. Uh, you can go in uh, feature requests. Um, you can go and sign up and, um, you know, put feedback in here, what you want uh, them to do. And then they have a roadmap right here. So they have planned over here. They have under review right here. So they're going to be introducing new pepper type images, 
uh, sentence shorteners, uh, increased rewrite word count limits, um, all kinds of good stuff. Long form content, like a long form content wizard, maybe something like what copy AI has where you just push a button and then it'll actually write the article for you. That would be game changing for them, but that hasn't been what they, what their main intention has been. They've been, this, this has been a very, very, very solid short form content, uh, AI writer. And that's the way that I would have, would describe it for the first year. They've been one of the best short form content writers, and they haven't really excelled at long form content, but it looks like that this is coming down in the works. Um, and then you can see what's in progress right now. Um, just little, little things like I actually critiqued this a long time ago, write count in notes. So I think it's like the words, the word count in the notes section. Um, they didn't have that in there, but they're going to add that little tiny feature in there. But those are just really good things to have. So um, looks like it's very active and so forth. So I'm going to come in here and just show you um, they have about I think I pre counted this about 42 modules it seems about right where they were at. Um, so they haven't done a whole lot of adding of the modules. I think at a certain point it does get a little out of hand um, having a hundred you know, copy AI has a hundred models, uh, modules to use, which is cool and all, but you can actually get to a point where you start getting lost, um, with having too many modules. So, um, but they have, um, really, really good stuff and you can still create really good long form blog content, uh, using the software. Um, I'm just going to show real quick. I'm not going to go over all the modules, all the different things. I'll make more videos over the next 10 days while this is on AppSumo. Let me know in the comments below if you want me to make more pepper type videos while it's available. So you can kind of see the software a little bit more. If you're on the fence, I can show you a little bit more of the software, but I'm going to come back up over here to projects just to prove to you and show you that I have used this software a lot. Look at this. Look at all the different projects that I put in this software right over here. Look, and all kinds of different stuff like manifestation code, like different uh, niches that I've been in, pumpkin coloring page. So I've done like different, uh, you know, different niches over here, affiliate marketing product uh, reviews, um, and just using this to create help me create content, right for multiple different um, reasons. Uh, I'm going to come over here to a, uh, this one, how to lose weight, and maybe we can just kind of open up that project and just see. So with this project right over here, we have blog conclusion intro and blog ideas and so forth, right. So uh, I'm going to go over here. We can add more content types, but in this project right here, we're writing blog articles for um, a weight loss blog, right? So all I really need is these blog, this blog stuff, right? So I'm going to go over here and I'll show you guys how to kind of start using pepper type real quick. So um, follow advice, uh, create content. So um, right here, I'm just going to say um, create content because I already have this filled out and this will go out and give me some blog ideas that we can go and utilize. Okay. So we're in here, um, the seven day meal plan to rapid weight loss, right? So it's giving us all these ideas. Why weight loss frustrates you the most common mistakes when dieting. So that's cool, right? So, and you can do a, uh, you can give it a thumbs up or a thumbs down and then it will tell the AI that it's doing a good job or not doing a good job with that output. I'm going to go ahead and copy this, right? And then I'm going to go back over here. So we can actually come over here to the notes section. And this is what's really cool. Now you have this notes section. We can put this um, and just kind of paste this in over here. I'm going to paste to note over here. And we have this right over here. And we're going to go over here into... Okay, so we have our uh, blog idea or title right here. Let's see what we can do over here. It's been a while since I've logged into pepper type. Uh, but it, and not a whole lot has changed. Uh, we're going to go over here and make this the title over there, but I like how you can have the notes section and it's, uh, taking up at least half the screen. So, uh, you're able to, uh, update notes and modify, um, on a nice screen. You can also, uh, minimize this at any time. And it's just going to go down here to this little tiny button over here. And it's just very, very easy to, uh, bring that back up. So I really like that feature. We can do some basic uh, formatting right here. As you can see, bold, italicize, underline, um, alignment. We can download. We can clear this at any time. Um, they still have not added in the amount of words right here on the screen. But like I said, we go back to the roadmap. That's actually right count in, in the notes. It's in progress, so they are adding that in there. That's really neat. So what are we going to do next? We're going to come back over here. And then I'm going to go over here and go into blog introduction real quick. And we can grab this content. I guess we can get rid of that period. I'm going to grab this uh, title over here and we can go and put this in as the blog topic. 
it's wanting us to even have more content in there, but we'll, we're going to see. I think that that's enough. Okay, that's good. It'll at least let us push the button, even though it, it's, it was asking for more content. So I'm going to read through these real quick. <laughs> I like this first one. Uh, as you can see, it gives us three really nice, solid introductions. And I also like this is good for blogging because it gets into the first person right here. Let's see, people are, is no way. Okay, so this one is more of the third person. And then this one right over here is also talking in the first person as well. So I like that because you can connect with your readers more and people really like reading blog posts where they can kind of connect um, on a little bit more of a personal level. Uh, we can create more outputs by clicking that button, but I think that these ones are good. I'm gonna go ahead and put my cursor over here, push enter and then paste to note. So that's really neat. I like uh, the way, see, some of the softwares that I reviewed recently, they don't have this feature right here where you can just, the simple, these simple features like this, they seem so simple and they seem uh, almost like, uh, why would you have to request that or why would you wanna request that? But you, you really don't realize how um, awesome these little tiny features, uh, interface features are. Um, until you actually don't have that ability and then you have to push the left click copy then come back over here and paste um, It just is a lot easier to just put your cursor where you want it and then and then you just push the paste button So I like that feature uh, We have an introduction now. We're gonna come back over here and There's different ways you can do this. We can push the back button like we just did a minute ago and see all the different options or we can just click this um, menu bar right there and we can go and just type in blog and then you're going to have all the blog options right here. We need a blog outline now. So I'm going to go ahead. It's going to pull the blog outline up. I'm going to go and grab our title again, throw that in and create content. So it's going to go out there and find a, a nice outline for us. And you can see just how fast pepper type is, um, the quality of the content that it produces. Uh, this is a really, really good, um, AI writing software. A quality one. Okay, so we can come through here and I'm just going to read through this real quick. Okay, so there's a little bit of each of these that I like. So I'm going to go and we're just going to paste this one in and then I'm going to go over here and paste this one in. And this is kind of how you would use this, right? Number four, I don't really like this one. It doesn't make any sense. So I'm going to remove that one and I'm going to add this one right here. And I think I like this conclusion better. So I'm going to go ahead and grab that and throw that in over here. All right, so we have our outline, we can get rid of these and that's kind of how I do that, right? So then now I'm gonna push uh, return right there. After each one of these, I'm gonna push return. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna come back over here and I'm gonna go to blog. And now we just need the blog heading expander. So I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna grab that and we're gonna go grab our content. We have our, our topic. You're gonna always put that in over here and then we're gonna grab the uh, first uh, this would basically be an H2. So we'd make all these H2s, but I'm gonna do that um, in a little bit. We're gonna copy this as the heading and then push create content. So it's gonna go out there and specifically write about weight loss frustration, uh, about how, you know, the frustration is a reality, right? It is real uh, that people deal with that. Yep, right here, it's more common than you think to be frustrated with slow weight loss. So it does specifically talk about it. So I like this one. Um, you can copy this by going like this you can copy and just put that in under here or we can use the paste to note right there as well then you would just come back over here grab this and make this an h2 so you can uh, see how you can uh, go in here and it's a little bit more like kind of customization you are spending more time creating this right so if i were to compare this to like copy ai copy ai's speed would blow this um, out of the water but I will say that the, the, the way that you have to write uh, long form content or blog posts using pepper type, it does make you be more involved with the writing process and actually see what you're, uh, what, what's being produced. Uh, so there are advantages to doing this way as well. Uh, you may end up with a little bit more tested and quality uh, content as well. So just to keep that in mind, we're going to copy this work. And then instead of going back right here, I'm going to say edit details. We edit de details and all we do is just put that one in there in the section heading and then we say create content. Uh, I'm going to show you this one real quick, then we'll come back to the conclusion and then I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up. So these ones aren't too, too, you know, I don't like them that much. I'm going to go ahead and just say create more outputs. So this first one actually does talk about um, a reason, uh, but you would want to expand on this. I'm going to go ahead and just put this in over here. I'm going to paste that in 
and then I'm going to go ahead and finish this up real quick and then I'll come back and show you the final results. Okay, so I've just spent a few minutes wrapping up this article and you can see I'm going to go ahead and do a control A, right click, I'm going to go do a word counter and we have almost 700 words that we have um, written with PepperType on this long form content. Now we can continue the process. Uh, obviously we would want to build this out more depending on how many words we need to rank. Then you could take this content and go put it into Neuron Writer or Surfer or Phrase and continue to optimize it, right? But uh, this is what it looks like. It's super fast, uh, clean, very clean user interface. Uh, they have not one thing I actually like about PepperType is that it's got a really nice, fast, quality user interface, but they haven't done a whole lot of changes to it. They've only made necessary changes, like adding the notes feature right over here. We can come back over here at any time, go back to home, access any of the modules over here, and at any time we want, we can just quickly go into our notepad and continue writing. So I really like that feature. They stay on point with just a couple. This has got to be one of the easiest user interfaces uh, that there that I've seen in a uh, AI writer. And that is a, a really good thing, actually, because when you look at this, there's not a whole lot of things that you can do. You click on a module, it opens it up, and then you get to writing right away. Okay. It's very fast. You can see. Um, and then they have these different uh, content packs. If you're uh, going with social media, then you can come over here and just look at the ones that are uh, social media or e-commerce right over here. I really like that. I've used that before. Product copywriting. Here's all the value propositions, feature to benefit, before and after bridge. They have all that. So really, really good at copywriting. And so um, I would say that this is um, closely related to Copy AI. Um, only Copy AI wins with uh, some of their um, features for long form content. Uh, but I think pepper type will be heading in that direction. It's just taking them a little bit longer. Um, but I do think this is a really solid product. Like I said, the notes feature that they added in about eight months ago was really, really, um, an awesome, uh, thing that allows you to uh, simply you stay inside the software while you're writing. So um, that's it for this kind of just tutorial. Just wanted to give you guys some uh, updates and most of all, just give you a heads up that this would be a top recommended. This is one of my top recommended AI writers um, on AppSumo that has ever hit AppSumo. It's pepper type and they are back on the platform for just 10 more days at the time of recording this. Um, you can pick up tier one for $99. That'll give you 50,000 words per month. License tier two, 100,000 words per month, up to five users on your team. And they're going to, they don't have this yet, but they're going to be adding a write more uh, command and uh, a way to command the AI. So this is in the works. You can, um, this will be released. I don't really know when, but um, I just wanted to go in here and make sure for inside of here. Um, we don't have, oh, we do have that command. Oh, good thing. I, I, I'm going to show you that. Okay. So if we come in here and we highlight this right here, we have some options. We can rewrite this text. We can expand. We can simplify and we can write a paragraph. Okay, wow. So um, I will be doing another video. I'm not going to be able to show that. Uh, I'll just show it real quick right here. But um, that happens, guys. Uh, I haven't logged into this in a while. I wanted to, uh, the main point of this video was to, to let you guys know that Pepper Type's available for 10 days. Go pick it up on AppSumo. It's a top recommendation. Um, and then I'll be doing some more videos. Weight loss frustration is real. We can actually go write a paragraph based on that. And it's uh, the wheels are spinning. It's going to go out and let's see what it does. Okay. So it went and just wrote this paragraph. We could come in here and we can just paste this right in here. Okay. So that is insane. Uh, so I'll do another video on this. Uh, I'll, we'll write another blog post together. It'll be a lot of fun. Go ahead and subscribe to learn wire, hit that like button, and I'll be back with another video. My next video will be on, on pepper type. All right, go ahead and pick this up. We'll see you next time.